The sound of generators fill this street in Bartlett as neighbors try to keep cool. It's just frustrating. Dripping with sweat, Mr. Billy says he was forced to get his generator working to preserve his groceries before they spoiled for the third time. And I came back home this morning, everything was thawed out, but the power was back on. So I went back to the store, spent almost $200 this morning, and come on the way back home, the power is out. Neighbors say this area has lost electricity over and over again this week as MLGW crews work around the clock to restore power to thousands. That power has come on at least five or six times and gone back out. Sometimes it'll stay on for an hour, and like I said, you think you're in the clear, you start washing clothes or you know running the dishwasher, and then it. it stops 45 minutes later. And Friday was no different for Melissa Sizzle. She lives next door and says with every glimmer of hope she gets when the lights come on, she loses hundreds of dollars in groceries. You make plans for the children, the pets, the groceries, you for work, you make all these plans and then just like that you have to, to start all over. Many in the neighborhood have packed up. There are no cars in the driveway. They are staying with family. Sizzle says she is forced to do the same. Currently, I've taken my children to my mom and I have pets here that I'm trying to stay with and try to keep them cool. As cool as possible as temperatures continue to rise across the Mid-South and so does frustration. It's extremely frustrating. In Bartlett, Shay Simon, WRG News Channel 3.